Whenever we need to build a list of items, we usually have an array or an object. In React.js, we use JavaScript map function in order to map the data from the array to elements on the screen. Let us see how we can transform list in regular JavaScript. I can't wait that long! First, define an array of numbers. In this example, the map function takes an array of numbers and multiplies their value by 2. We assign the new array returned by map to the variable res and log it. And we can see the output. Now, let us see how we can create a list in React. First, create a component named users component. Next, define a list of users. Now we will use the map function for traversing the list elements. We return a li element for each item. Finally, we assign the result array of the elements to user lists. Now include this new list inside ul elements and render our component to the DOM. And as a result, we get a bullet list of users. By the way, if you expect your console, you can see that we have a warning that a key should be provided for list items. A key is unique identifier. In React, it is used to identify which items have changed, updated, or deleted from the list. It helps to determine which components in collection need to be re-rendered instead of re-rendering the entire set of components every time. The best way to pick a key is to use a unique string from your data. If you don't have it, Use the index of map function as a last resort. One note is that the key should always be placed at the top element inside of the map function. You should never nest it. And now you can see that our code executes without an error. If you don't want to store the list in the variable, you can place it directly in the JSX. Just place the map code block in the curly braces and you get the same output. And that's it. Don't forget to like, subscribe and I'll see you guys in the next video.